Hello, YouTubers. It's Champion DJK coming at you yet again with another new mainline casting review for 2016 Hot Wheels. And uh, this time we got the Porsche 911 GT3 RS. There it is. It is 8 of 10 in the Hot Wheels Exotics. It is number 78 overall. This is first seen in P cases. Uh, the rear-mounted 4-liter flat 6 takes this high-performance vehicle from 0 to 60 in 3.3 seconds, while the pit speed button quickly cools the engine for control on demand in those tight corners. So there it is. Birthplace in Germany, of course, 2016. Let's take it out. So here is your Porsche. Uh, pretty basic. We got metal body, plastic base. We got uh, small... Uh, GT3 RS tampo on the rear, a uh, small Porsche emblem on the hood. Uh, we got lensed headlamps that are part of the uh, windshield piece. Pretty basic wheels. Just a nice looking, you know, basic casting. Let's go ahead and take a look at the tampo work real quick, up close. There's your GT3 RS. Pretty neat. And let's take a look at the front here. There's your uh, Porsche logo. There's your headlamp. Pretty cool. And that's all we're going to look at real close on that one. So, of course, it's based on the Porsche 911 GT3 RS, the 2016 Porsche 911 uh, GT3 RS, which is a rear, en rear engine, rear drive. 4 liter flat 6, yep, 0 to 60, 3.3 seconds. That motor produces about 500 horsepower. Top speed for this vehicle is about 193 miles an hour. Um, pretty interesting in, uh, about this, too, is it's got rear axle steering. So the rear wheels actually steer, help steer the car. So it's kind of neat. They kind of, you can watch it on YouTube. There's some YouTube videos of it. They kind of turn real slightly. It's not like they have a turning circle like the front would be, um, but really, really neat. Uh, suggested retail price for this car is $131,000. So $131,000, you can own one of these Porsches for yourself in real one-to-one uh, -one scale. Um, so, and there it is. Um, so we got to rate this casting, of course, on a scale of one to three stars. One being I don't like it, two being it's okay, and three being I really like it. And I'm going to give it two stars. I'm not sure what exactly it is about this one, but something bothers me about this casting. Almost like it looks a little squished, maybe, and not as long as it should be. I don't know. There's something weird about it. When you take a look at this car, and then you take a look at the side of this one, maybe I'm nuts, but I think there's something about the sloping back doesn't slope as much as it should, or seems too short, maybe. I don't know, something is weird about it, and it kind of bothers me, and I'm not sure what it is exactly, but... So, there's that, and I'll give it two stars. Let me know what you think in the comments down below. Did you pick up a bunch of these? Are you going to do some customs with it? I know I'm probably going to try to do a custom with headlights in it, for sure, because it's already set up for it. So, I'm definitely going to be taking one of these apart um, and doing something cool with it. But uh, that's going to be pretty much it for this one, guys. Let me know what you think, as always, in the comments down below. Thank you very much for watching, and have a great day.